everybody. I am saying hi to you all and here today in a different background. Um, as you can see, I am baking. I am actually baking pan de bono. Um, it is a Colombian bread that's actually a, it's made from cheese. Um, I made it from Mexican crumble cheese and um, it's absolutely delicious. It's crispy on the outside. Um, golden brown and then on the inside it's just delicious it's, it's it looks like bread but it spreads out kind of like cheese and it's really really tasty so I just wanted to share that with you I'm gonna show you the end result as soon as it finishes baking but in the meantime I could give you a quick rundown of what some of the ingredients were so basically it is uh, 12 ounces of a rounded Mexican crumbling cheese. I like to use the fresh one. Um, then I add in a half a cup of uh, tapioca starch. And it, then I add in, um, it's two tablespoons of, sorry, yeah, two tablespoons of um, corn flour. And if the, cheese is not overly salty I add one teaspoon of salt and also one teaspoon of sugar and one egg so that's what it takes to make pan de bono and um, it is absolutely delicious <laughs> and if anybody's curious I did get the recipe off of YouTube um, so if you do want to find out more about the steps um, please, you know, just type in pan de bono on YouTube and you will definitely find it there. It's, YouTube's amazing because of all the knowledge that's uploaded from everybody, so. Ooh. And also, you, um, if you're doing it in conventional, like, toaster oven like this, it's around 425 degrees Fahrenheit. And if you're doing it in, like, an air fryer, which I'm also doubling up in my air fryer, um, you do that for like about 175 degrees, but if it doesn't go that low, I think 180 would be fine. Just keep a close eye on it.